Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is a VMware certification VCP6 uh, data center virtualization video training and this is the introduction video and <coughs> let's see what's what I have to uh, build this domain environment so my physical machine is SP, HP Compaq Elite uh, 8300 if you want to verify here is my model, model number you can see hardware information Havel Packet Compact Elite 830 and I have a uh, operating system installed Windows Server 2012 R2 data center editions and the CPU is i7 3.40 gigahertz you can verify the same also here is like uh, CPU information and RAM information and also you can verify the operating system Microsoft Windows Server 2012 R2 data center edition and <coughs> We require a uh, few software, few applications uh, for building this uh, VCP6 lab. So the first thing is hypervisor, uh, which provides the platform to run the virtual machine. As I, I have uh, configured this physical machine to run the, all the uh, required virtual machines like ESX host, vCenter, my Active Directory servers, everything. So yes, uh, hypervisor is required. I am using VMware Workstation. 11 if you want to verify here you can go you can see the if you go help about the VMware workstation you can verify the version I am using VMware workstation 11 and and also you require ISO image of Windows Server 2012 to installing uh, the your Active Directory server and server for uh, like a vCenter server which we are going to promote as a uh, vCenter server so Windows Server 2012 ISO image and you require the ESX6 ISO files which you can download from VR, uh, VMware site I have down already downloaded if you want to go let's go to my ISO folder so here it is and I have VMware ESX Server 6.0 and here I have like my hypervisor installer f uh, file which is uh, almost uh, 350 MB and the second is my uh, vCenter server ISO image which is around 2.5 GB so both is required and you require also the virtual SAN or open o o virtual SAN which is uh, you can use the Starwind or open filer which is a Linux based uh, open file uh, a virtual SAN so in this lab I am going to use the uh, Starwind so here you can see I have installed the virtual SAN on my local server which is server 01 and I have created one target so uh, I will explain you how to create how to install and how to create the target on uh, virtual SAN and these things and how to map the devices and later later videos so in this all the demo I am using five virtual machine the first virtual machine is Win2K12 DC01 you can verify the IP address here 192.168.1.254 here if you go you can verify <coughs> my so you can see Active Directory and DNS role is installed on my server if you go here on local server you can verify the so server name into k 12 dc 01 and my domain name is victorinfosol.com my IP address which is configured and the second server is vCenter server you can verify the IP address 192.168.1.253 and I have assigned 12 GB RAM for this machine so uh, to building the uh, vCenter 6 you require minimum 8 GB RAM on vCenter server so I have is assigned uh, like 12 GB RAM and if you go here you can verify the vCenter server and I have joined this machine in my domain which is victorinfosol.com nothing is installed on this server the, the machine is uh, basically uh, uh, fresh installation I have just uh, renamed the machine and con configure the IP address and join the machine in domain that's all so other three I have ESX host 1, ESX host 2 and ESX host 3 which is basically a 3 ESX host which I am going to use in this demo then the, this tutorial so I have installed a uh, 2 on 3 already uh, in production like uh, uh, for the demo and I have not installed the ESX01 which uh, which I am going to install in later on videos uh, and like how to install the ESX host uh, 6.0 so this is all about the information which we are going to uh, use in this demo 
so thank you for watching please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any question related to this please post me on my given mail id thank you once again bye bye